Uh, can you climb vertical walls? He is a gecko. Hopefully they did think that through. Ooh, let's try it. Seems vertical enough. Oh, it seems like he wants to. Huh? I mean, yeah. Holy, wow. My mind's been blown, okay. Guess that's another benefit for having one. Oh, so this is why geckos are just amazing. <laughs> Can't do that with a ladybug or a grasshopper. Okay. They don't aggro that thing. There's plenty of stuff here. Um, I assume I need to go to the axe for this. Need flint pickaxe to harvest bark. Not an axe. Okay. That's quite surprising. But hey, you know, whatever. <laughs> I mean, I want level 13. Oh, that's the thing, actually. Has my... So, I, so recently I swapped to this new UI thing. With, like, the last, latest follower and all that stuff. Okay, cool. It has updated. Okay, cool. I wasn't sure if it worked or not. For some reason, I don't hear the notification sounds. <laughs> um, Which is odd. But... Yeah. No, mm. So luckily, because I now have like things popping up in the chat when someone uh, like subs or follows or whatever, I actually saw it this time. Okay, so there's more flint down there. Maybe I should like. Might be there's some problem with OBS sometimes and put it to the top. Yeah, for some reason though, I don't have. It's not in my audio mixer. Either, so it might not have audio, which is weird. See what this gives us. What does this give us? Uh, seeds and fiber. What are seeds for? Oh, seed oil. I need that, actually. Hmm. Maybe let's just go down here and harvest a bunch of stuff. There seems to be a lot of flint here as well. Let's do a sweep of the foxtails. Oh, there's another gecko over there. Luckily, I don't... Wait, I get XP for harvesting stuff? I don't even know that. Okay. I really want to know what this does. <laughs> I mean, this is good enough anyway. It's fine. Yeah, why not? What do I get? Oh, three XP per thing I've harvest. Okay, does that change depending? The graphics are actually really amazing for this game. Yes, a hundred percent. Like I, I love it. It's it's nice just to admire the scenery. Ignore that bit. That's <laughs> hmm. But like you know, the lush vegetation and all that. I don't even know what settings I'm on. Hold on, let's have a look. Graphics. I'm on high. So I'm even on the highest. Wow. Arsiv, hello. Welcome to the channel. How are you doing? What is my level? 13. Why do you ask? Good. Is that good? <laughs> I don't really have any frame of reference. <laughs> um, 
You can be 100 max. Oh, okay. Wow, 100? Oh my god, okay. I'm very early game then. Jeez. <laughs> um, what is that? It's like a floating decal. <laughs> Amazing. Please don't aggro gecko. Okay, so I finished the game. Just wait next. Wait, what? Just wait next page. Okay. So I'm curious, right? Since you've completed this, you might be able to answer this question for me, right? Oh, God. Ooh. Ow. Ow. Go on here. Um, what does the internet intellect stat actually do? Like, like, does it unlock new recipes later on, or what? Yes, that's another good thing about having a pet, is that it um, stops you from getting hurt. <laughs> oh, hello. Alright. Go cannibalize it. Oh no. That's fine. <laughs> so this roach meat. You eat that? There we go. Let's get in there. My pickaxe is nearly broken, that's not great. Be careful. Okay, that's good to know. Yeah, the only reason I did is because I was... Yeah, that's fair. It's a good shout. Thank you. Um, it's over here. But the thing is, there's a high chance I've already been around here, but I've like... Like I said earlier, I've not played in a while, so... It's all kind of fresh to me. Again, weirdly. Look at that beast of a bug over there. It looks huge. Is he coming for me? No, okay. <laughs> Alright, so what are these? These are standard mushrooms. They are. I might grab some while I'm here for more food. It's cheap and easy. Yeah, Arisif, how, how did you find the game then? You said you finished it, right? Oh, what's that? What is that? What is that? I don't like that. Let's go this way. <laughs> what is that? It's so dark. <laughs> Water bug is weak to blunt damage. Oh, that's what it is. It's a water bug. Okay, so I need to switch to the hammer. Let's see if it attacks me. Okay, he's trying to attack me. <laughs> oh. oh. Dark Souls saved my life. <laughs> Don't go there for now. Okay. <laughs> let's, let's not go there. <laughs> Is it a harder place? I'll put those mu Let me go. I'm just going to grab those mushrooms. Just for the mushrooms. Don't enter caves. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's fine by me. Hint received. <laughs> it's so dark, man. Okay. Let's try and make our way back now, I think, because things get horrible at night. I have, like, nocturnal versions of things which just always attack you. Get some wood. 
Um, it might actually be worth mining some stone while I'm here. Okay. Oh, actually, I need these foxtails for their seeds so I can get some more um, better wood. Oh, I see another water bug over there. I'm going to go. The game is so much pretty. Enjoy. Thank you, Arisa. Thank you for the tips, man. I appreciate it. And hopefully see you again soon. <clears throat> hey, thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. Okay. Um, no more fox tails. There's fox tails there, but I'm worried about that thing. Is that another? Is that a nine water bug? That seems higher level than the one in the cave. <laughs> that doesn't seem right. Oh, let's just go. Let's just leave. Let's go home. I need to go repair my stuff anyway. So can I like jump onto this? No. Okay, that doesn't work like that. What about up here? Okay, so. It can't climb like sh extreme angles, it seems. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. It's still good. Okay. I expect night is more dangerous, or is it not usually the case? It is. So, um, a good example of this is when you see grasshoppers during the day, they're completely fine and friendly and all that. But at night, they turn bad. Like, their eyes turn green and, like, they become nocturnal grasshoppers, basically. And they can... Oh. <laughs> I <laughs> My first base that I built in this, before I moved to the tree, seemed to be directly on a spawn point of them at night. Um, so, yeah, they're just more dangerous monsters. Like, the passive monsters are just... Why is that candy cane? What? Hello? Oh god, they're still after me. Okay, we're leaving. <laughs> so you got moths? Are they evil? No. Um. Right. So, I'm trying to see if we can find a nocturnal creature, just to show you. Oh, this button here, by the way, this is V. It's literally, this is your instinct. Essentially, um, which lets you see like re gatherable items, and then also they got nocturnal. A ne oh my god, nocturnal ladybug that will attack me. Can I climb up this? Oh my. Okay, cool. Um, yeah. So you can see um, creature weaknesses, their resistances, and stuff like that when you're in that mode. Just to help you in combat, basically. Oh, they, there's a grasshopper. So grasshoppers are normally like level three or four, right? That thing, please be higher. Uh, otherwise, it's going to be very awkward. He's level six. So he's vulnerable to blunt. He has low health, lots of stamina, decent damage, and decent speed. He's actually almost decent. <laughs> Again, I don't really have... Oh, look, he's coming after me now. Oh god, okay. No, that's not gonna work. Ow! Okay, man. Nope. Ugh. Okay, I'm getting off this. Let's get off. There we go. No, I can't. What's your week two? Blunt, okay. Oh my god, he just destroyed him! Good job. Come on, Gizmo. <laughs> oh, I see. This is why I was having trouble getting up here. It's because normally you come up that way. <laughs> okay. Let's go up that way. That way I can bring Gizmo with me. Oh, I thought I... Oh, that doesn't look healthy. 
<laughs> okay. So it's turning daytime now, so if we see a grasshopper, it will be peaceful. Okay. Here we go. This is a. Oh, what the hell? Oh, God. Anyway, there we go. <laughs> Perfect. Let's jump off. Ow! Oh! No, Gizmo! <laughs> Bollocks! <laughs> oh, don't die! Please just teleport up here. Oh god. <laughs> Hold on. Oh god, he's not teleporting up here. Okay, I need to go back down. Uh was that an NPC camp you found five minutes ago or another player or something? Uh NPCs. So it would have been this guy here. So when you first leave the Oh there he is, okay, he's fine. Oh, he's getting swarmed by wasps. That's not good. Please don't die, Gizmo. Okay, let's go help him. Right, what he's weak to? Oh my god, he's bloody fighting an army. Um, three. Oh. Ow. Oh, that was a big damage. Ugh. <laughs> Ow! Oh my god, I might actually die. <laughs> okay. Okay, I thought Gizmo was dead then. No! Gizmo, you get out of the way. You fool. Hey! Teamwork! Okay, he's fine. His health is fine. <laughs> that could have gone horribly wrong. Okay. Let's go. <laughs> um. Come, oh my god. Come on, you fool. There we are. Oh, the well, was eventful. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so, um... There are NPCs that you can go find. Um, it's how you get recipes, like um, new recipes. You can go talk to them. Um, when you start, you start here. Um, and then you get a quest to basically go talk to these three people. Him, him, and then him. Um, I've spoken to them, that person, this person. This person then gave me a quest to go talk to this person. But I've still need to go up there and talk to that person. So it's kind of like... Ugh. Okay. He's like a very silly giant dog. Exactly. <laughs> Alright, so let's cook mushrooms. Beetle sausage. See, the weird thing is, right? These are all the exact same nourishment, right? Blocks nourishment loss. Can heal creature. That's the exact same thing for the exact same amount. And mushrooms are just so much easier to come by. And then again, I guess you could just farm ants, couldn't you? Okay, before I do that, let's repair my stuff. Oh no! <laughs> I, I, hmm. I need to get my wood back. Um, was it resin? I think it was resin. Yeah, there we go. And spear. That cost a lot. <laughs> okay, um, so I need a bunch of seed oil so I can make some refined wood. I'm just going to grab a cup. I'll be back in two minutes. Alright, appreciate it. No worries. I'll still be here. <laughs> Now, what the hell did I need refined wood for again? <laughs> Can't remember. Um, get a blowgun. 
I have bone? Where did I get bone from? What? I feel like I need to get better armor. But how the hell do you get herptile leather? Can I get any better tools? I need bandages, definitely. I need bandages just to get health. Um, it's better about a bone mace. 16 to 22. That's not that much different. That seems weird. Why is that? Okay. Ladybug travel kit. Yeah, as well as backwards design. Backpacks designed to attach to their f four wings. Providing additional carry space for ladybugs to carry. Pet whistle. Perfect for calling your pet back to your side in an instant. Ooh, that sounds useful. Aerial fabric soaked in honey. Okay. Primal armor. What is this? That looks so cool. Um, okay. Upgrade stuff as well. Upgrade my hammer, upgrade my spear. Um, I don't need to repair anything. Okay, so let's figure out. Oh, not that. Uh, I need to go back up here. So I need the hammer back. What do I need to make these other things? So I can make a cabinet. Ooh. Okay. Oh, I can make. Hmm. <laughs> like a cannery. That's what I should make. That's probably where I make leather from. That makes sense. Holy crap, this is huge. Collision? What's it colliding with? Oh, is it colliding with... Wait, what? It's fine there. But not over there. That's mildly annoying. Can I go up against this wall? No. Um, oh wait, I can go, oh, is it backwards? Is it... No, that wouldn't make it, any... wait, what? Okay, <laughs> sure. What can we do here? Oh yeah, there we go, herb tile leather. It need a herb tile hide. I can't remember how I got that. I just... Hey, welcome back. Um, okay. I've got some herptile leather. So then I can make something? What do I need for the apothecary table? I just need stone, really? Oh my god, okay. Do I not have any stone? Is it in here? There you are. Okay. So, look at that, that looks so cool. Okay, I kind of want to swap them around now. But that's one thing that's annoying with this, right? You can't just pick things up and move it, you have to completely dismantle it. Okay, so this is the way it's meant to go. There we are. Alright. The only thing I can make in this is the haptile leather. So then I need to dismantle that. Uh, see? And then it's. I need, ooh, a lumen spindle. I need silk. That's where I need to find the spiders for. <sighs> okay. Apothecary table. There we are. Okay, what can I make in this? Health elixirs. Ooh. Drink, to uh, drink this concoction to recover a decent amount of health. Right. That's poison. Stamina. These sound very useful. 20 health. Wait, is that 20 health over 3 seconds? Or is it 20 health for 3 seconds? Hmm. Hmm. It does sound very useful to make though, so I might make some of that. 
swap away from that. So that was annoying. All right. So I need to. Where did I do? What did I do with my? I've got. I've literally just forgotten what I needed. Nectar. Did I have nectar? Yes, I've got plenty of nectar. And petals. Do I have any petals? No, I do not, because that's some of the stuff that despawned. Okay, cool. Sigh. <laughs> okay. Um, let's stick some stuff in here. Insect wings. Interesting. So we'll stick them in there. I've got meats and stuff, which... Did I put a chest down here? I didn't. I probably should. Just for, like, cookable things. Not that. That one. Stick this next to here. Yep. So we want that in there, that in there, um, that can go in there. I think that's everything. Oh, ants had the cookable beetle heart, I think. <laughs> Insect fat adds unique flavor to baked goods. Use a common ingredient in recipes for cake, pie, and cookies. What? You can make cake, pie, and cookies? Oh. <laughs> That's amazing. Okay. I realize I lost a lot of food as well with that stuff despawning. That's very annoying. So it's my own fault. Okay. Um, baking party, anyone? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, right. One thing I wish this did, one thing I wish every single survival game did, is pulling from chests nearby. It's like having all these down here and then my chests up here would mean, maybe not this, this seems a bit too far away, but like these would be able to access, these things would access everything that's in these chests. It's like, yeah, it would be nice. <laughs> But again, it's just one of those things. Pet whistle, that sounds so useful to make. But my inventory is so massively filled. Oh. Don't I have firefly juice? I don't even remember. Okay. Let's upgrade my armor. That's probably not a bad shout. But then I might as well use the, save the chitin for... um. See, I can't even fully upgrade it, can I? It's named that leather, which I don't have. I need two. I need to find more of that. I don't remember what... What did I kill that dropped that hide? Was it the gecko? I don't want to go on a gecko killing spree. That just seem, seems weird and not something I want to do. <laughs> That's an interesting thing. Pressing escape does nothing. Even though down here it says press escape to close. <laughs> That's fine. Okay. Right, basic mats are going in here. Um, stone basic? I'd say stone's basic. Uh, oh wait, no, I was going to make some health potions, wasn't I? What did I need for that? I need seed oil. I need petals, so I can't make it anyway. Okay. Um, so we'll do this and there, this and there. Still same type. I forgot that's a button. Yeah, exactly. I don't think Gizmo would like that. <laughs> um, yeah, let's stick the hammer back in here. That wasn't the correct hammer. That's the correct hammer. Um, my spear, my torch. Unfortunately, you can't like, um. What's the word I'm looking for? You can't... Repair. <laughs> you can't repair torches, which makes sense. That's a bit unfortunate. Uh, okay, so we got... Uh, is that... No, this one. I want to put bark in this one. Uh, leather in that one. Wood. We can go in here. Insect feathers can go in this one. Actually, no, they can move into this one. <laughs> Let's stick the rest of it in here. Okay, so I need to go grab my mushrooms. Cook them up just so I can have a small. F that's not the right thing to do. That's the right thing to do. 
just to cook them up. Oh, I see. So it's three makes one. Okay, so that's the downside to using it. But it's whatever. All right. Um, I wouldn't mind making some bandages as well. So I need to find my just simple bandages should be fine. Let's do this. Simple bandages, just make a bunch. Like ten, that should be enough. I hope. Okay, let's stick this on to there. So we have our health, our food, and we have our healing on our action bar. Speaking of, let's eat. One thing I don't recall is if there's a difficulty setting in this game. Oh my god. Just try to kill me. Okay. Wee. <laughs> Okay. I'm trying to think, is this a good spot to be? Have my camera, or should I do it like? That's fine. <laughs> Come on. Just wants me to mount him. Okay. So, where do I want to go? Um, I need to find spiders. I need to find that lever. Do I? Try going west. I feel like that's probably the best place to go. As the code is personalized, as you said earlier, at the start your game, you choose if you drop blue on death. Yeah, 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 true. That is very true. Um, so we're gonna go west. Like, but the thing is, you can change that on a whim. It seems. So hold on. Can I save? If I save the game here. Right, if I return to... I'll, I'll show you what I mean, I'll show you what I mean. So... Play. Moi. So here we go, 